If I'm gonna dog sit you, you can't stare at me like that, okay? What? What is that look about? Look. I didn't ask for this. You got me into this mess, okay? I didn't ask for you to fetch this from Victor's house, okay? And I didn't ask to know that Brody might not be Liam's father. What am I supposed to do about it now, huh? Brody. Bet your Uncle Victor loved this, huh? Just having something to hold over John's head. That's if it's even real. I mean, I can't tell Natalie unless I know for sure, right? What's that supposed to mean? I think a bark is just a bark. Oh. Hey, sweetie. Mom's being silly, isn't she? <laughs> yes, she's talking to a dog, and I'm silly. Especially since the dog probably doesn't have a uh, horse in this race. Yeah. Do you? It's not my call, Jess. Whether your sister's wedding goes off without a hitch or not, it's up to you. So, this is the infamous David Vickers, huh? Mm -hmm. So it's just you looking after this pooch? Yes, Tina is off planning for the wedding. You know, I almost feel sorry for Natalie, but I guess... I guess it'll all be over soon, right? The wedding is tomorrow. Yes, in less than 24 hours, my twin will be marrying my ex fiance There's got to be a country song in that, huh? So... That means you only have a day to deal with what you know. So I speak now. Or forever hold your peace. Did you have fun with your daddy last night? Are you kidding? We had a blast. <laughs> we always have a blast, right? <laughs> what did we do? We went and we rode the train in the park, the little train, yeah? And then, and we blew the whistle. You should have seen it. He was laughing so hard. And then what did we do? We went home and we watched Chaplin movies. <gasps> Right? Charlie Chaplin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, I figured it's kind of like a gateway. There's no words. You should have seen him. He might become the next Spielberg or Coppola. Are you guys okay? Are you guys ready for matching Oscars? Listen, if it's what he wants to do with his life, I'll support him in anything he does. Right? What's wrong? I can't take it. I have to tell the truth about Liam. So you're going to tell the truth about Liam? Yeah, I'm ready. What changed your mind? You, with Ryder. Well, I didn't mean to guilt trip you or anything. Of course you didn't. I was just thinking about how close we came to never knowing that you were Ryder's father. Yeah, well, I can't imagine life without this little guy. I know, and it almost happened because my dad wanted to play God, and I was so angry at him for that, and I can't do the same thing to Natalie. But we still don't know if the test results are legit. I mean, there's still so many questions. Yes. John deserves the chance to find out those answers. And what about Brody? Brody? God, I don't know. It's so cruel. The only thing worse than finding out now is him finding out later. After he's gotten the family that he's always wanted. And, uh, Natalie? Natalie deserves the truth, too. You sure you want to do this? Yeah. I mean, I, I, the secret, it's awful. It's all I think about. I, I can't sleep. And when I do, it's all I dream about. I can't live like this. So when are you going to tell Brody? Well, it's not really my place to tell Brody. Or John, for that matter. The only person they should hear this from is my sister.